This is a CBS News special report. I'm Margaret Brennan. There has been a shooting at a municipal building in Virginia Beach, Virginia, with at least 11 people dead. Jeff Begays has the very latest. Jeff? As you reported, there are 11 people dead, but that is a number that could rise because there are many more injured. Police say a disgruntled employee is responsible. He is now dead. He was shot by police. According to investigators, all of this happened at about 4 p.m. That is when this active shooter situation unfolded. And among the injured is a police officer who investigators say was saved because he had a body armor vest. The initial shots were fired at around 4.30 this afternoon. And we have multiple live victims that are coming out. Police rushed to the scene with some taking cover behind vehicles. We are still actively clearing the building for victims and secondary suspects. The active shooter situation was centered in Building 2 of the Virginia Beach Municipal Center, which is located next to City Hall, as well as the police and sheriff's departments. Shalia Cook works in the courthouse. We heard shooting. We heard shooting, but we didn't think it was that close, that close, like in proximity of the building. So I just thank God that they were able to alert us in time because if it had been 10 minutes more, we all would have been outside. We got suspect coming out, main entrance, building two. Give us an ambulance. Shortly before 5 p.m., police reported that there were multiple injuries and just one shooter who was in custody. Jim Severa is the Virginia Beach police chief. The fact that the suspect is deceased means that our citizens can, can rest easy tonight. So in addition to the 11 dead, there are six injured. And as I reported, that is a number that could rise. And this was a relatively quick police response and still 11 dead. Federal law enforcement is helping with the investigation. Margaret. Jeff Pegues, and we will have much more on this developing story ahead. This has been a CBS News special report. News 24 hours a day. Go to CBSNews.com.